Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to fix packet loss in Valorant. All right, just go ahead and go to your favorite browser and check your internet. Just type in speed test and hit on enter. As you can see here, there are two options that you would want to choose. First one here is the speed test by Google itself or the speed test by Ookla. I'm just going to go ahead and run this from Google. All right. If you can see a decrease of performance right here of your internet, you might want to try to restart or reset your modem or router. All right. Now, after that, go ahead and restart your computer as well. Launch Valorant and check if it helps. Now, if that will work, go ahead and go to your search bar and type in CMD. All right. In here, in here, just type in ipconfig space forward slash release. Hit enter. Another one, ipconfig forward slash renew. Hit enter and wait for the process to finish. Another one, type in net sh space windsock space reset. Hit enter. Just go ahead and close the command prompt and restart your computer. Once done, check Valorant again and check if it helps. If that still won't work, go ahead and go to your network icon right here at the bottom right. Right click on it and hit on open network and internet settings. And here, just head over to change adapter options. All right. Now in here, just double click on the network that you are currently using. All right. Just a tip here. Don't play using Wi-Fi. All right. As you will get a higher chance of getting packet loss. All right. I'm just going to hit on properties right here. Then go ahead over to Internet Protocol version four. Double click on it. Now in here, you might want to try this DNS from Google. Go ahead and pause the video and copy this thing out. All right. Once you're done, just hit OK. Run Valorant again and check if it helps. Now, if that will work, double click on IPv4 again. Change this one to uh, Cloudflare's DNS to 1.1.1.1 and alternate 1.0.0.1. After that, just hit on OK. Close this one. Close everything. All right. Relaunch your Riot client. Play Valorant from a Riot client and uh, everything should work perfectly fine now. That is it. I hope this video helps and I'll see you in the next one.